Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Everyone, fucking cross your fingers and pray to the maker, fucking darkspawn gods and old gods or whatever the hell gods we're fucking thinking about right now. Every god in every fantasy world that you've ever read, that this game allows me to play for more than half an hour without freezing. <laughs> I've looked up like 280 solutions. So far, the game hasn't frozen on the main menu, and I hope that this solution has worked. I've actually had to disable one of the cores on my processor for this game using the task manager, which may or may not have fixed the goddamn freezing. I never expected to be able to run this game on full settings. My computer's processor is outdated and needs updating. But uh, we should at least be able to play it without too much fucking lag. <laughs> we should at least be able to play it Without constant freezing. <laughs> I really want to be able to play this without constant freezing. Okay, uh, after much thought on this, uh, we were either going to go dwarf. Or we were going to go human for my uh, first playthrough. The first playthrough is usually just me getting used to the game and everything. And then I do an ultimate playthrough afterwards. But uh, we'll only do one playthrough for now. And I'm thinking the first one that we'll play... Hmm... I usually go by Ray, so my Kunari is going to be tall, badass, and just the evil option, just beating the shit out of everyone and doing what needs to be done. Um, I'll probably have a female elf mage, which will be my taking the piss out of her situation, hilarious character. And my human tends to be the goody two shoes, trying to get everything, you know, diplomatic guy. So I think, yeah, we'll go with the human. It's my, it's my, sort of always my default first playthrough is the human. Uh, you got rogue with two swords, uh, archer, two-handed, weapon and shield, and mage. Weapon and shield's always my default. Again, that's what I always play first time through. Uh, never playing the game before with Dragon Age, I always go with uh, sword and shield and human. It's like my default. And being a nice guy is my default. So we've got nightmare, which we're not doing. And the truly mad, it doesn't get much challenging to this. Yeah, we're, we're doing it on normal. I might have a playthrough, we'll just be on casual for the story. But we'll do this on normal. Okay, yeah. as the youngest child of the Trevelyan, yeah, Trevelyan Noble House, you grew up in the Free Marches city of Oswick and have enjoyed a life of privilege. With close family ties to the Chantry and many relatives among the priesthood and the Templars, you're always expected to follow a similar path in the service of the Maker, regardless of how you feel about the matter personally. Willingly or otherwise, you were sent to the Chantry's Conclave to assist relatives who sought to make peace between the Templars and the Mages. It didn't go well. So I lost family in the explosion, did I? That's interesting. World State Import. Yes. Um... This world state is not precisely the one that we did previously with my Dragon Age Keep Road to Inquisition video. Basically all the same choices, but um, I went with my default again, which is just human. That's what we, we've gone with. Human screwing Morrigan and getting a human child, uh, because I know that you get to meet them later on. Spoiler. But they, uh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure we do anyway. Someone told me you do. I haven't actually seen it. Someone said you do to me. Uh, they could just be pulling my chain and being a prick. You never know. Don't judge the graphics of this too badly, by the way. Like I said, my uh, processor is rather shit. So the settings are on, like, medium. They're the best. Although the, uh, the texture quality I've put up to high. And the mesh is high as well. Because if you put the mesh setting down to medium or, or anything other than high, everyone's hair turns to plastic. I don't know why. <laughs> But if you put the mesh uh, settings and the graphics options down uh, under high, everyone's hair is just shiny as hell. They've put just so much hair gel that it's ridiculous. Like, if you were a mage, I'd be worried that it would combust into flames if you do anything near it kind of thing. Okay, this could take a while. Um, <laughs> if, if, uh, if anyone's like me when it comes to RPGs, I spend an unhealthy amount of time customizing my characters, so we could be here for a while. Okay, is that good enough? I'm not entirely sure. Everything you've heard? Completely true. You leave me no choice. You leave me no choice. How much is this going to cost me exactly? I don't think it looks too bad. I could spend... I could s spend his... like... 
I could sit here all day doing this and just slowly tweaking it and never be 100% happy with what the guy looks like. It's the thing, me and RPG games, see, I don't really like that scar next to his ear. I think his ear might be a bit too small. I don't particularly like his eyes aren't exactly as I'd like them. I think his cheeks are a little weird. Uh, also picking about the nose as well of his nostrils. I don't know. <laughs> God damn it! We could be here all year doing this, so I'm I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bother. That's it. We're going with that character. He doesn't look too bad, I don't think. He's got looks, right? He 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 ain't he ain't so fugly that no bitch is gonna want him, you know? Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> You don't know they're too bad. Looks like a average noble, I suppose. The background moves with you. It kind of looks weird. Alright, I'm going to accept the changes and roll with it, otherwise we will be here all fucking week with me in the character creation screen. Name your character. Uh, what the hell do we name you exactly? Um, Rob? <laughs> Must I drag Game of Thrones into every single series that I do? Hell, if you want to uh, think about dragging... Uh, talking about dragging Game of Thrones into every series that I do, check the thumbnail for this series. The Inquisitor is wielding Longclaw and the Red Keep is in the background to the top right-hand side. <laughs> so yeah, we're going to go with Rob. For better or worse... <laughs> spiders. I hate, I fucking hate spiders. Run, Rob! Okay, climb. Slowly. Stop looking back. You've seen them already. They're fucking spiders. We're dead. The end of the series. Thank you for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Fuck off. <laughs> yeah, I have spoiled myself already with the prologue to uh, Dragon Age Inquisition. I couldn't wait to play it, so I was like, screw it. I'll watch a video of the introduction. <laughs> At any rate, hopefully we can get through all of this without the game crashing. I've, I've uh, done that uh, cl closing off one of my quad core things, and hopefully that's fixed our problem. Tell me why we shouldn't kill you now. The Conclave is destroyed. Everyone who attended is dead. Except for you. You think I did? Uh, okay. Keep it in mind, my character's diplomatic. He's a noble. He likes the idea of, you know, trying to do what's best. So, yeah. What do you mean everyone's dead? Explain this. I can't. 
What do you mean you can't? I don't know what that is or how it got there. You're lying! We need him, Cassandra. Well, those people, you can cry, you can get bitchy, you can get confused. What now? So, what happens now? Do you remember what happened? How this began? I remember running. Th things were chasing me, and then... A woman. A woman? She reached out to me. But then... Yeah. Don't worry, Liana. Go she didn't look as fine as you loved. Don't worry. Liliana. I will take him to the rift. Pauliana always was jealous. What did happen? It will be easier to show you. We call it the Breach. It's a massive rift into the world of demons that grows larger with each passing hour. It's not the only such rift, just the largest. All were caused by the explosion at the Conclave. An explosion can do that? This one did. Unless we act, the Breach may grow until it swallows the world. Each time the breach expands, your mark spreads, and it is killing you. It may be the key to stopping this, but there isn't much time. How can I stop this again? You say it may be the key. To doing what? Closing the breach. Whether that's possible is something we shall discover shortly. It is our only chance, however. And yours. You still think I did this? <laughs> to myself. Not intentionally. Something clearly went wrong. Oh, clearly. If I'm not responsible. Someone is. And you are our only suspect. You wish to prove your innocence? This is the only way. I understand. Then... I'll do what I can. Whatever it takes. Me and my incredibly shiny shoulder blades will uh, assist in this, Cassandra. Don't worry. I got your back, love. They have decided your guilt. They need it. The people of Haven mourn our most holy, divine Justinia, head of the Chantry. The Conclave was hers. It was a chance for peace between mages and Templars. She brought their leaders together. Now they are dead. We lash out like the sky, but we must think beyond ourselves, as she did. Until the breach is sealed. There will be a trial. I can promise no more. Come. It is not far. Where are you taking me? Your mark must be tested on something smaller than the breach. Okay. Where are we going, Cassandra? You're going to lag out on those rocks, love. I'm not sure if it recorded that, but it keeps doing that, and it's really very annoying. <laughs> Every now and again, it just catches on itself for some reason. I'm not sure why, but at least it doesn't, you know, crash. <laughs> I 
Anyway, we'll continue on, and I apologise if it does that weird, glitchy, catchy thingy again. The more rifts, for 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 rifts, the more demons we face. Stop doing that! survive the blast? They said you stepped out of a rift, then fell unconscious. They say a woman was in the rift behind you. No one knows who she was. Everything farther in the valley was laid waste, including the Temple of Sacred Ashes. I suppose you'll see soon enough. 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 For Christ's sake. Enough. 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 Okay. I'm going to save, and I'm going to, like, turn up uh, the... Guide that I found did say to turn back on the uh, processor thingy that I had get us doing it again. Yeah, we can't continue like this. I need to fix it. Uh, be right back. Okay, I've turned all my processors back on, and hopefully that fixes it. It's weird. It's like the audio is catching, but I don't know. At least it's not crashing, right, guys? Guys? Yeah. Ah, okay. <laughs> I never had this problem with console games. Oh crap, there we go. We're okay. I spoke too soon. Stay behind me. Or I could get that conveniently located sword and shield just laying around. Face the right of Morgrain! <laughs> okay. I got a battle cry by the looks of it. Can I block with left? No, left changes thing, okay. It's over. Drop your weapon. Now! Yeah, you need to trust me. If you're going to lead me through a demon-infested valley, you'll have to trust me. Give me one reason to trust you. Because my life is on the line. <sighs> you're right. I cannot protect you. And I cannot expect you to be defenseless. I should remember you agreed to come willingly. There! Watch out! Yeah, I'm gonna loot first, if Cassandra. If we flank them, we may gain the advantage. Ah. Make a take! I may have to adjust some of the settings a bit to get a better frame rate. Fraps is really kicking the shit out of it. I so I fear my processor is the cause of the uh, game being a bit slacking. Up on the hill, it attacks from a distance. I should really look into what that Warcry uh, spell that I have does, to be perfectly honest. They're falling from the breach! I thought we discussed that already. We know they come from the breach, right? I do believe my Warcry thing gives me like a momentary buff to armor, something which means I should probably keep spamming it when possible. We're getting close to the rift. You can hear the fighting. Who's fighting? You'll see soon. We must help them. Quick! 
Quick, Hello, Varric. Before more come through. What did you do? I did nothing. The credit is yours. At least this is good for something. Whatever magic opened the breach in the sky also placed that mark upon your hand. I theorized the mark might be able to close the rifts that have opened in the breach's wake. And it seems I was correct. Meaning it could also close the breach itself. Possibly. It seems you hold the key to our salvation. Great. Good to know. Here I thought we'd be ass deep in demons forever. Varric Tethrus, rogue, storyteller, and occasionally unwelcome tag along. Are you with the Chantry, or...? <laughs> Was that a serious question? Technically, I'm a prisoner, just like you. I brought you here to tell your story to the Divine. Clearly, that is no longer necessary. Yet, here I am. Lucky for you, considering current events. It's good to meet you, Vary. You may reconsider that stance in time. Ah. Oh. I'm sure we'll become great friends in the valley, Chuckles. Absolutely not. Your help is appreciated, Varric, but... Have you been in the valley lately, Seeker? Your soldiers aren't in control anymore. You need me. Ugh. My name is Solus, if there are to be introductions. I am pleased to see you still live. He means I kept that mark from killing you while you slept. You seem to know a great deal about it all. Solus is an apostate, well versed in such matters. Technically, all mages are now apostates, Cassandra. My travels have allowed me to learn much of the Fade, far beyond the experience of any circle mage. I came to offer whatever help I can give with the breach. If it is not closed, we are all doomed, regardless of origin. That's a commendable attitude. Merely a sensible one. Although, sense appears to be in short supply right now. Cassandra, you should know. The magic involved here is unlike any I have seen. Your prisoner is no mage. Indeed, I find it difficult to imagine any mage having such power. Understood. We must get to the forward camp quickly. Well... Bianca's excited. I don't think my character know who the hell Bianca is. So, are you innocent? I don't remember what happened. That'll get you every time. Should have spun a story. That's what you would have done. It's more believable, and less prone to result in premature execution. I hope Liliana made it through all this. She's resourceful, Seeker. We will see for ourselves at the forward camp. We're almost there. Take that green ball of light. Rift is gone. Open the gate. Right away, Lady Cassandra. We are clear for the moment. Well done. Whatever that thing on your hand is, it's useful. Ah, here they come. You made it. Chancellor Roderick, this is... I know who he is. 
As Grand Chancellor of the Chantry, I hereby order you to take this criminal to Valroyo to face execution. Order me. <laughs> Try it. You are a glorified clerk, a bureaucrat. And you are a thug, but a thug who supposedly serves the Chantry. We serve the most holy, Chancellor. As you well know. Justinia is dead! We must elect a replacement and obey her orders on the matter. Isn't closing the breach the more pressing issue? You brought this on us in the first place! Call a retreat, Seeker. Our position here is hopeless. We can stop this before it's too late. How? You won't survive long enough to reach the temple, even with all your soldiers. We must get to the temple. It's the quickest route. But not the safest. Our forces can charge as a distraction while we go through the mountains. We lost contact with an entire squad on that path. It's too risky. Listen to me. Abandon this now, before more lives are lost. How do you think we should proceed? Problem will be addressed sooner, but there may be casualties. Uh... Uh, okay, we'll go on this by uh, the video that I watched was charged with the soldiers I haven't seen taking the mountain pass, so. Use the mountain pass. Work together. You all know what's at stake. Liliana, bring everyone left in the valley. Everyone. On your head be the consequences, Seeker. The tunnel should be just ahead. The path to the temple lies just beyond it. What manner of tunnel is this? A mine? Part of an old mining complex. These mountains are full of such paths. And your missing soldiers are in there somewhere? Along with whatever has detained them. We shall see soon enough. That cannot be all of them. So the others could be holed up ahead. Our priority must be the breach. Unless we seal it soon, no one is safe. I'm leaving that to the man with the glowing hand. <laughs> Bring it on, bitches! Shield wall isn't actually an ability that you uh, like maintain. It's you hold it and you block. Sealed as before. You are becoming quite proficient at this. Let's hope it works on the big one. Thank the Maker you finally arrived, Lady Cassandra. I don't think we could have held out much longer. Thank our prisoner, Lieutenant. He insisted we come this way. The prisoner? Then you... It was worth saving you, if we could. Then you have my sincere gratitude. The way into the valley behind us is clear for the moment. Go, while you still can. At once. Mm -hmm. Ignore my horribly <laughs> shiny shield. The same. <laughs> Definitely need to fix that. To be clear of demons as well. Let's hurry before that changes. 